Indonesian President Joko Widodo welcomes MotoGP drivers at the Presidential Palace in Jakarta Wednesday morning before releasing them for a parade. Okay. Indonesia to host second session of MotoGP between March 18th and 20th at Mandalika Circuit on Lombok Island, West Nusa Tenggara. Besides photo opportunities, MotoGP racers and officials also had a chance had a chance to see President Widodo's motorcycle when he showed them his vehicle that is usually used when he joined such kind of parade. However, this time President Widodo did not participate in the parade that's held in central Jakarta area. Langsung bertanding di sirkuit Mandalika di hari Jumat, Sabtu, dan Minggu. Dan kita tahu, Alhamdulillah juga, bahwa uh, target uh, tiket yang telah kita berikan 60 ribu, Alhamdulillah semuanya sudah terjual dan kita harapkan ini menjadi sebuah uh, brand baru, negara kita bahwa Indonesia sekarang telah memiliki sirkuit MotoGP yang tidak kalah dengan negara-negara lain. Saya rasa kita nanti bertemu saja di Mandalika. MotoGP racers expressed their joy after receiving warm greetings from Indonesian President Joko Widodo at a presidential palace in Jakarta on Wednesday. After seeing Indonesian public enthusiasm, they cannot wait for participating in the Mandalika racing this weekend. There are races uh, this week. Good, I mean, really, really good, really motivated and looking forward to make the first GP in Indonesia. After a long time ago, last time I think was in 97. So really looking forward. Mandalika is a really nice track, really nice place to, to make the track. So we will try to, to enjoy the weekend and to make a good result. Good start. Okay. Uh, how, how do you think about the Indonesian uh, Mandalika? Good, I mean, it's the second, well, third time that I'm here. Uh, first, I came in 2020 and I saw the fans that really passionate and this uh, also really, really good. Also for, for Honda, it's really important, the market that they, that they have here. So, MotoGP need to be in Indonesia and it's a really good news to, to see us here and to make the first GP after a long time. What's your target for uh, race this week? I mean, we'll try our best, we'll try to make a good uh, weekend and we'll try to, to be in the top eight, I think is the, the target for this weekend. Okay, thank you. Thank you very much. Yeah, it's incredible, yeah, I can see the, all the Indonesian fans, so yeah, it's great. I was a little bit too hot, but anyway, a great event and I want to say thanks to you know the, all the presidents and uh, make uh, make possible, so I'm really glad and I'm really looking for the, this weekend. Well, you know, he's really kind, you know, just we talk about because we are Asia and uh, was really kind and I'm really happy to, you know, possible to talk with him and uh, yeah, I'm happy and hopefully he, he will enjoy the, the MotoGP weekend. Yes, I'm good. I mean, you know, uh, a few days ago I arrived here and uh, preparing for the physically and I'm good and uh, also we had the uh, three days stays in Mandarika and it was good test, so uh, I can wait uh, this weekend. The circuit is amazing, the layout is amazing, so I enjoy a lot on the, doing the test, so hopefully, you know, a uh, great weekend for everyone and hopefully uh, for all the fans, is hopefully enjoy a lot. You know, the Indonesian Ministry of Transportation, together with state-owned shipping company Pelmi, will provide free floating accommodation for MotoGP Mandalika spectators.
KM Kalut Public Vessel anchored at Gilimas Lombar Seaport in West Lombok is ready to welcome 1,500 spectators' facilities prepared on board KM Kalut ready to welcome MotoGP Mandalika spectators. Besides bed, the ship has other facilities such as cafeteria and entertainment. Spectators who can show their MotoGP tickets Fully vaccinated certificates and COVID tracing application Paduli Lindungi are eligible to stay at KM Kalud. To reach Mandalika circuit from KM Kalud, free buses are prepared for spectators. It will take about 30 minutes drive from the seaport to Mandalika circuit. Uh.